had to stop to uh, walk the dog, so Luna just wanted to say hi for a second. Can you say hi to everyone? Show them how cute you are. Yeah, there she is. Okay, back to our workout. Bye bye. Hi everyone, it's Laura from lauralondonfitness.com where I help busy women get hot and healthy at any age. Today I have a brand new workout for you using the Pilates ring, magic circle, whatever you wanna call it. I love this piece of fitness equipment. So what you need today is a mat, a Pilates ring, bottle of water, and you know, bring your energy with you. Come on back and we're gonna go get started. So the first thing we are going to do, I call it intuitive stretching, right? Because it's so important to stretch before you work out. So we're gonna take our ring. I'm hoping you can see me in the camera. I'm so low today. We're gonna take a nice wide stance with our feet and we're just gonna bend to one side. Feel that stretch. Inhale, exhale. Come back to center. Take it to the other side. Couple deep breaths here. Exhale, come back to center. Now we're gonna take that kind of like a clock. We're gonna go one side stretch, center, the other side stretch, and center. Let's do a couple more here. One and two, beautiful. Now we're gonna take our ring, and we're still gonna hold it above our head. We're gonna take it into a nice circle around the body. It's gonna help stretch out the back, the low back, warm up the legs. Here we go. We're gonna do five in one direction and five in the other. That's one, good. Two, I'm so glad you guys are here with me today. Three, I've missed you so, so much. Four, and five. I'm actually puppy sitting my daughter's dog today, so Luna might make an appearance in the video, I'm not sure. One, two, she's running around in the background. Three, four, and last one here is five. Beautiful. Now let's stand, I'm gonna stand sideways so you can see me. We're gonna hold that ring above our head again. We're gonna push our hips forward while we lean back just a little bit. Really opening up that front of the body, the hips, that stretch feels so good. If you want, you can look up right through the top of your circle, up at the ceiling, if you're outside at the sky and let's bring that back down. Beautiful. Now we're just gonna warm up the arms. So we're gonna do some nice arm circles. Just get those joints ready for what's to come. You know I start off slow and then we bump it up. All right, let's reverse that arm. Here we go to the other side. Feels really good. Beautiful, one more here, and let's switch it to the other side. Coming around, coming around, good. Couple more here, let's reverse it to the other side. I took a hula hoop course yesterday. It was so much fun. So you know I'm going to be incorporating some of that. So let's, this is some of it. Watch this. This is called a, a figure eight. So we're just going to take that ring in front of the body, back and forth, up and down. Let's do a couple more here. One, two, my couple is three, three, <laughs> and let's switch. We'll go to the other side so it, it crosses in front of the body. You twist it and it comes back, right? Just go with it. Go with, with whatever feels right for you. No right or wrong. We're just warming it up right now. All right, two more here. One, 
and two. Good. All right, now we're gonna start working on some upper body. So let's take this ring. I like to do a staggered stance, one foot in front of the other, so I get a really nice, strong footing. I'm not sure if you can see my feet. If not, you can put your feet about hip distance apart, no right or wrong. Let's take this ring out in front of us, our palms, <clears throat> are out, fingers are out, and we're gonna squeeze in for the chest for 15, here we go. One, two, right? Three, doesn't move that much. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15, good. Now I'm gonna bring my feet together. We're gonna bring that close to the body. The elbows are back. I'm gonna squeeze here for 15. One, you can hold it, two if you want. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, keep it going, 12, 13, 14, and 15, beautiful. Now we're gonna reverse that. We're gonna put it in, I put my wrists right there, You um, and we're gonna push it out now. So let's push out for 15. One, two, you're gonna feel those shoulders. Three, four, working immediately. Five, six, you got it. Seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, that's it, 14, 15. Bring it in, 15 here. I'm gonna stand sideways. One, two, three, four, five, six. Can you think, see, seven, eight. Muscles working, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. All right, let's take that ring now. We're gonna bring it over our head. We're gonna do just some squats here. My feet are wide and we're going down. So we're squatting, one, two, warming everything up, three, I'm cracking away, four, five, six, seven, making sure your knees are not going over your toes, eight, you're sending your hips back, look, nine, 10, good, 11, 12, we've got 15, 13, 14, and 15. All right, woohoo, shake those hips out. Feels really, really good. All right, we're gonna take our ring and we're gonna put it on the side of our hip and we're gonna press down and in. This is what it looks like. Boop, it's shoulder and it's a little core. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, you can put your hand here, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, core is nice and tight, 14 and 15. Let's switch it to the other side, here we go. One, whoop, let me get a little straighter arm there. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15, good. All right, now we're gonna take that ring like that, do a little spin. All right, we're gonna pull it back, kind of like a bow and arrow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Switch it to the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Awesome. Okay, you ready? We're gonna start stepping it up here. We're gonna do alternating knees and ring, okay? Just join in, let's do it. Let's get that heart rate up a little. 
We're gonna be going down to the floor, doing some lower body, some core. We're gonna get it going. All right, if you want to, you can really pick it up or stay at your own pace, right? These workouts are adjustable to you and your own body. Okay, let's do six more. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Nice. Take that ring up over your head. We're gonna twist and twist. Your foot is twisting, your whole body is twisting. We're getting some spinal rotation. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Really twist it. Seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, we're going for 20, 14, 15, 16, 17, you got it, 18, 19, and 20. All right, bring that ring down. We're gonna take it down to the mat. Take your ring. You're gonna get a chance to lie down, but don't let that fool you. <laughs> All right, we're gonna lie down. You're gonna take your leg, your um, ankle is holding this ring so it's staying up. I call these over the rainbows, they're in another one of my videos, one. And we're gonna go over so you're tapping down with your toe. I'm gonna put the links to all my other Pilates videos here, the ring videos. So let's start here. I'm not counting, so let's go one, two, three, you're gonna feel it right here, four, five, this is zone specific, six, yes, seven, oh, just wait, eight, I'm gonna start with 10 with you guys, nine, and 10. All right, take a break or put your leg over, and we're going up and down. I also want you to brace yourself here, pull your core in. One, you're leading from your heel. Two, don't be in a rush. Three, we're holding it there. Four, that's it. Five, uh-huh. Six, seven, I know. Eight, nine, let's do 10. 10, very good. Now we're gonna bring knee in and out. One, like this. So I'm gonna count. One, two, three, four, five, you gotta keep it going, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Now we're going up and down for that last 10. You got this. One, oh, two, three, I'm feeling it. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Oh my gosh, bring that leg down in front of you. Just kind of give yourself a little slap there, that muscle, right? Whoa, hello hips. Take your ring and let's flip over to our belly for a second before we do the other side. So I want you to put your wrists on top of the ring. Just kind of let your head hang down. Take a deep breath here. In, out. Now let's push down on that ring. Push down to rise up. If you do yoga, this is like a cobra. So you're getting a nice stretch in your core and you're flexing that spine that's so important. A couple more here, let's do two more. One, last one here, two, just feels so good. All right, let's flip it to the other side. Gonna put the ring here, we're gonna go again. All right, remember, brace yourself. Your abs are nice and tight. We're going for, I think we did 10. Here we go, one, two, three. You got it. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Now we're going up and down here. One, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, work it, eight, nine, ten, ten in and out, one, two, three, four, five, you got it, six, yes, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Woohoo! Feel that burn, the London burn. All right, I'm gonna just flip to the other side because I can see you guys better in the camera. You can stay on that side or turn around. I'm gonna lie down, so I need to move my microphone. We're gonna lie down on our back. Just feel, press your back against the mat. Take out any tension that might be there. Feels really, really good. All right, we're gonna take that ring. We're gonna put it around just below our ankle bones and we're gonna squeeze out. So we're working here, the outer hips again, flexing the feet. Let's go for 15. One, two, you feel that? Three, right away, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Good. Drop it down. Let's see, right above the knee. Never on the, the knees, but right above. Again, another 15. One, two, three, four. Right there, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 and 15. All right, bend your knees here. Same thing, 15 here. One, two, three, four. You feel it just a little differently, right? Six, seven, good. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. I told you just because we're lying down, doesn't matter, we're still working bringing it back down to those ankles and we're pushing out again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Oh, feels really good. All right, let's take your legs, I mean your feet, Flat on the floor, walk your feet out to the edges of your mat and just drop your knees in, right? We just worked the outer hips. Let's just stretch them a little. Bring it, we're gonna do some inward rotation. Yeah, internal rotation, good, feels good. All right, now we're gonna take the ring and we're going to do the opposite. We're going to put it just below our ankle bones, but inside of our legs. Our feet are flexed and we're squeezing in, working the inner thighs for 15. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, ah, six, feel it. Seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15, good. One of the most underused muscles. All right, we're putting it right above those knees again, squeezing in, count them with me, I wanna hear you. One, two, three, four, five, feet are flex, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 and 15. Oh, that was awesome. All right, we're gonna take it, actually, let's put it just around our knees. Feet are flat on the floor and we're gonna take it up to hip lifts. You don't want it too tight because you wanna be able to move. So we might need to adjust it and just bring your feet like close together. We're just gonna do a little hip lift, okay? Because this is kind of keeping you from going all the way up, but we just wanna stay here. Give me a few more here, let's do five. One, and squeeze those glutes. Two, three, four, and five. All right, now take that ring off, just put it over your head, and we're gonna do 20 here. One, two, three. Let's move the ring while we're here. Four, 
five, really squeeze it. Six, seven, good. Eight, yes, I said 20. Nine, 10, 11, you're feeling this? 12, push from your heels. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, yes, 18, 19, and 20. Very, very nice. Okay, we're gonna do a little, let's do a little core here. So we're gonna put it back around um, our legs, uh, below, blah, 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 below the ankles. I like to put my hands underneath for support. And we're gonna bring the legs down, just so you feel like, uh oh, maybe I shouldn't go any lower, and then come back up. One, if this stresses your back out in any way, two, bend your knees. Three, and if that still does, skip this exercise. Four, never do anything. If you get that little voice in your head, I always say that says, uh, I don't know about that. Maybe I shouldn't do that. Please listen, right? Everything an exercise instructor gives you is a suggestion. It's up to you to know what's right for your body, right? It's super important. We do not want to get injured. All right, let's do five more here. One, two, three, four, and five. Very nice. Okay, we're gonna do the opposite here. I'm gonna keep my hands underneath and we're gonna roll up, just up. One, just, right? <laughs> Two, three, kind of working more the lower at four, five, it's a little roll. Six, nothing big. Seven, we're not using momentum. Eight, nine, 10, 11, we're gonna do 15, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Great, all right, let's take that ring out. Okay, so here, we're gonna start in a seated position, gonna lean forward. You're gonna feel a nice stretch in your hamstring, maybe your low back, make sure you have enough room. We're gonna lie it down, ring comes up, back, and sit up. One, that's it. If you're having a hard time with this one, maybe bringing your knees to, and still if it's hard, just come up and down, all right? Just keep moving with me. Three, that's all. Four, Five, you notice I'm not in a rush, I'm not using momentum. I think my whole body's moving off the mat. Six, I'm traveling. Seven, you got it. Eight, let's do 15. Nine, keep it going, come on. 10, we're almost done. 11, good. 12, three more, 13, good, stretching to 14, and 15, very nice. All right, we're gonna do a little stretch. Actually, I do a whole stretch routine with this ring. I think that's gonna be a separate video, but for now, we're just gonna do one of my favorite stretches. So we're gonna take that ring, and pull on it, your feet are flexed, and just pull yourself a little bit forward, just a little bit. You're gonna feel that in the hamstrings, in the low back, just feels nice, right? So now we're gonna let one hand go, we're gonna bring it over the body, and behind us, really close to the body, and just stretch. So pulling, if you wanna come, you come back here, 
Just giving it a nice, nice stretch. Couple deep breaths in and out right here. And when you're ready, bring that arm back. And now we're gonna rotate. Nice stretch. Bring it to the other side. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Maybe on the exhale, you can twist a little more. One more breath here. Beautiful. Bring it back. Now just bring your body. Look forward, forward, forward. Don't round your back. It's not about getting all the way down. It's just about feeling that beautiful, beautiful stretch. All right, let's take that ring off. You guys did an awesome job. So proud of you. Like I said, I'm so happy to be back. This was just one of my newest videos. Thanks for working out for me. If you have not, please subscribe to my channel so you'll get all the new videos. There's also a little bell. Click on that bell because then you will get all the new videos I put out and know when they're out so we can work out together. I want to hear from you. Leave a comment below how you like this video, what other types of workouts you'd like to see. And that's it. Come visit me at lauralennonfitness.com. I'm gonna put the links below also to my other Pilates ring workouts and where you can actually get the ring. So have a fit and fabulous day and I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.